How do you feel Eric. Kerry Hyder did playing defensive tackle next to you? Next question. Eric, I'm sure the uh, injury was frustrating, but I guess the upside is maybe fresh legs at this time of year. How, how fresh do you feel uh, right now? Um, I feel fresh, but you know, still getting uh, getting myself back. Uh, you know, it's still knocking the rust off. Um, I feel like I'm getting better and better each game, so that's been good. Couple more. Uh, man, he was a true rock of playing with his injuries. Um, were you got were you seen aware of kind of where he was physically and, and what does it say about him that he was able to play? Yeah, I saw it. Uh, you know, I was getting some some rehab myself, and uh, he's been he was hurting uh, last night and and today, and um, you know to gut gut it out and have that type of performance, um, you know shows shows how tough he is. It shows uh, his character. Um, and we definitely needed that in a, you know, the biggest game of the, the season. And so, um, you know, my hat's off to him. And I think as football players, we, we understand uh, how hard it is to play through injuries and play through different stuff. Um, so to see, you know, one of your teammates have a, a gutsy performance like that and, um, you know, play through that injury and play through all that pain, you know, you definitely have a different level of respect for him. Anything else? Yeah, just how do you feel about, I mean, you guys, with the defense you guys have, all the offensive playmakers you have, to, you know, the most important position on the team, the quarterback, to have it as a rookie, not only a rookie, but a seventh round draft pick. How do you guys feel about where you guys are right now with him and where you can go this season? Yeah, I think, uh, I think you know, they've been doing an excellent job. Um, when you look at all the weapons we have on offense, you know, somebody's bound to go off. Um, you know, just it just depends who that day. Um, and, you know, those guys, Debo, Christian, George, IU, um, you know, Jawan, all our, all our skill positions, Ray Ray, um, you know, they're, they're bound to go off at, at any time. And so it's hard to, when you have so many weapons, to keep all of them quiet um, throughout a game. And so uh, it's definitely to our advantage. When you talk about all those weapons, you have a lot of weapons and stars on this team. Is it unusual, do you think, that there's not so much ego and it's really just the right takes to win the gallery? Um, I don't know if it's unusual. You know, I've been here, you know, eight years. Uh, so I've seen the, the culture and the, that, um, you know, Kyle and John have built here. And uh, I, think it's, I think it's been like this for a while. Um, you know, we love playing with one another. We have a lot of fun. Um, everybody's happy for each other's success. And, you know, we really don't bring in a lot of guys who, uh, who you know, are the opposite of that, you know, are self-centered. And, um, you know, more focused on themselves. And, uh, you know, they do a great job of, you know, who they bring in and add to our culture each year. And, um, you know, the, the main guys who have been here kind of, you know, continue that culture um, each year. But, you know, I think it's not, it's not unusual because I've been, I've been here. I don't know what it's like other places. Eric, you, you know better than anybody how hard it is to win here to clinch a division for a second time in four years here. Any, any extra meaning to do it on this field? Uh, yeah, for sure. Um, Definitely tough. Uh, I've only done it twice in my eight years. So that shows you how hard it is. And uh, to do it against Seattle, we wouldn't want it uh, any other way. Um, a team that has uh, been a thorn in our side for uh, since I've, ever since I've been here. So to get it done against them definitely felt great. Did you have an immediate sense who you had an advantage on your offense? Uh, no, they have, a, they have a good offensive line. Um, they got two rookie tackles, so um, you know their their tackles aren't as experienced as, as other uh, other guys. Um, but they have a solid offensive line, and um, you know we definitely had to had to get after them and tackle them. Um, you know, it just wasn't wasn't easy. With, with all the injuries you guys have had at defensive tackle, you put a little bit more on your plate to to ramp up your game to compensate for all the losses? Yeah, I definitely put a lot on myself. Um, I know this team uh, is going to need me to be my best uh, down this stretch and, uh, you know, to get to where we want to get. So definitely put a lot of responsibility on myself to go out there and, uh, you know, do my job at a high level.